Whooping outdoors with cute cuddly animals may sound great, but being an agricultural journalist in New Zealand is no easy feat. Experts say passion and persistence is needed to crack into the industry. There aren't a lot of jobs, to be fair. There never will be, and there never was. But it's a matter of, of if you're determined to do something, you'll do it. And I guess I was determined to be an agricultural reporter when I got there. Agricultural journalism could be seen to be a narrow profession, but it attracts many journalists seeking a rural lifestyle. I've loved the career. I love it very deeply. I still do, and um, I'm glad I've done it. I would never do anything else. Young budding journalists may find rural reporting isn't just a walk in the park. It can be a challenging profession with late nights, travelling and tough terminology. It also takes time and effort to build strong relationships with people in rural communities. So what makes a good agricultural journalist? Like farming, the job's weather dependent, so being able to work in snow, sleet, sunshine or rain comes in handy. Experts say young ag reporters need to be able to empathise with farmers and building rapport with key people in the media industry and farming sector is vital. Yeah, I think the relationship between journalists and the PR people working for the primary sector are extremely important. While agricultural journalism may be a shrinking profession overseas, people here say it's needed and are happy for it to grow. It's in our interest to make sure that everybody knows what's going on with rural New Zealand and um, rural commercial New Zealand. So, um, yeah, we're as supportive as we can be. Young journalists are advised to grab their cameras, rain jackets and their red bags and to get out there and have a go. Georgia Forrester, Massey News.